I'm checking out this short clip of uh, Stell from SP19 discussing how David Foster asked him to perform all by myself. If you want me to check out more SP19 or Stell, make sure to smash like and subscribe. Let me just check this out. It's like five minutes with English subtitles. Uh, let's go. Tapos hanggang sa bigla sinabi na may concert na ako si Sir David Foster here. Tapos medyo naglag na ako. <laughs> <laughs> kilala ko siya eh, by okay. heart. I know him by heart. Kilala kilala ko By his songs. Yeah, songs. by his songs. And nalala ko po kasi ano, nag-comment siya before sa isang random TikTok video ko. Okay. Nag-comment siya ng emoji na parang shock siya. Okay. Na kumakanta ako something na ganoong content. Okay. Parang yun po yung siguro dun niya po ako nakita. Right. And parang sinabi ko nga uh, ano, Ah, he did, yeah, they did. Any song naman daw po pwede ko po ito. So, okay. nung tinanong po namin, paano po yung setup ng performance ko, sabi po nila open act lang po. Okay. So, nag-prepare po ko ng three songs for the album. Yung po yung All I Ask, then yung debut single ko na room, and then yung Defying Gravity. Okay. Tapos, um, yung All By Myself kasama doon. Wala po. Oh. Wala po sa plano. Actually, ito po yung funny na story. Okay. Like, like, he, <laughs> he, he, that shows you how much of a good singer he is. If you could just be asked to perform this big song just out of the blue and he had not prepared for it. Wow. During rehearsal, po, pinakita ko sa stage to practice my three, three songs. songs. Mm. Pero nagulat po ako, nag-rehearse po si Sir David. So, akala ko po, uh, nag-rehearse siya, so mamaya po po, ako standby ako. Pero nagulat po ako, tinanong niya, kung sa'yo ito na po yung ears ko. Actually, may video po kayo. Siguro po post ko po siya anytime soon. Okay, okay, so, okay. sabi niya, do you have your ears on? Sabi ko, yes. So, do you want to try this song? Tapos ako sabi ko, what song? Sabi niya, all by myself. So, sabi ko, oh, am I going to perform this song tonight? Okay. Then sabi niya, yes, we can try. Tapos parang ako nagulat nila ako, napatingin po ko sa mga tao ko sa mga ngayon. Tapos parang, kasi lahat po kami walang idea. Okay, 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 okay. Pero sinabi po sa amin nung show director, na ganun daw po talaga si Sir David. Minsan binabago niya po yung lineup ng concert niya. Oh. Binabago niya yung, ano, yung pagkakasunod-sunod. Right. Binabago niya yung song. So, right. ano po magustuhan niya kung feeling niya paano mapapaganda yun. That, me that means that if you're working with David Foster, that you should always like, eh? You should always be like, ready and versatile. <laughs> he might change things around any second. So, nagulat po kami na bigla niyong in-offer niya. Tapos pinractice po namin siya, pinlay niya, pinakanta niya lang sa akin. Pero ako, nung buong time po na yun, gulong-gulong po ako. Sabi ko, bakit po kinakanta ko? Hindi ko naman itong pinractice po to. Pero nag-go-wit the flow lang po ako kasi siyempre nakakahiya naman po mag-no. Siyempre, right. hindi foster po yun. Pero so, familiar. Say, saying, no, saying no would just be odd because it's such a big opportunity and yet you, uh, you idolize the person that is, you know, he said David Foster, he knows him by heart. That's what he said, right? So saying no to him would just be so odd, and yet he's like his idol. And ah, oh, that, that was a tough one. That was a tough situation. He's so polite if it's okay with you, so he's so polite. <laughs> Okay. 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 So after po ng three songs ko, mas kinabahan po ko kasi random na po yung dami na pong tuwata ko sa isip ko that night. Sabi right. ko, hindi ko na po alam sa dasal na lang po ka ng dasal. Lapit ko ako ng lapit kay Coach Brenna, nagpapatulong ako. And then yung buong team talagang tinahype po nila ako. Right. Parang nila na manarit support ko, manarit po siya support ko sa isa. Nakadagdag pressure ba na bago ka kumanta, pinlay yung interview ni Celine Dion? Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, anytime... 
anytime a singer has to go sing a song and the original singer has just been mentioned, you just feel so pressured to live up to the to the to the level that the original singer you know sang the song. Right. Right. Na pressure ba na bago ka kumanta, pinday yung interview ni Celine Dion oh, good, talking so about the na. song. Sobrang pressure ko talaga. Actually, ko, pagka nakikita ang videos sa social media, iniisip ko, ano ko nagawa <laughs> Ay, ganun, factor ko eh. Tapos, yung sinabi niyo ko kasi yung pinakakinabahan ako na instead, you only get one chance to try this. Okay. Sinabi niya? Sinabi niya po yun before, before ko po ito. Before, before, before. The show or... That's that's so much pressure. That's so much pressure. Celine Dion's interview has just been shown. You're singing in front of someone that you idolize. Yeah. And he handled it so well. The show or chance to try this one. Yeah. So and you nailed it. Ko, ko. <laughs> <laughs> you um, nailed it, Sarah. Sana po, sana po, ang nagustuhan po, and sana naging proud po yung uh, kababayan natin. You know that. Oo. Oh, oh. so, wala po ko iniisip that time eh. Sabi ko lang iniisip ko. Not, not just people from the Philippines, but I I think all SB19 fans were very proud. <laughs> you um, nailed it, Sarah. Sana po, sana po, ang nagustuhan po, and sana naging proud po yung uh, my mind was really floating it goes to show you that even like big performers like Stel can can become nervous and like need time to like internalize when big things happen. Eh? After po ng performance, may mga nag-interview sa rito, pero sobrang lumulutang po talaga yung utak ko. Sobrang lutang ko. Wala po akong ibang maisip kundi ang like, after po mag-perform nila, kitang ko po agad yung coach niya. So, coach, okay po ba yung ginawa ko? Kasi sobrang kabado-kabado po talaga sa MJ. Hindi ko po alam po na-deliver ko po sa yung tama. Kasi yung ginawa ko lang po noon, talagang hinawakan ko yung mic, kumanda lang po ako, hindi ko po pinapansin yung mga tao sa paligid. Talagang nakatingin lang ako kay Sir David. The way he performed that song, you'd not think that he was having like any nervousness. Kasi lang ako pinapanggap ko po yung piano, yung banda, yun lang po talaga. So, wala po akong idea sa nangyayari sa paligid, but I'm very honored and I'm feeling blessed po sa opportunity na binigay sa akin ni Lord, binigay sa akin si David. Totoo po pala yung sinasabi nila no, na parang always be prepared kasi hindi mo alam yung opportunity mm -hmm. na dapat sa so, Well done. Well done. That was so well explained. I've really enjoyed that. If you want to see my reaction to those performances by Stella, leave them here in the comments. Um, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.